so we've got this problem and I think isolation means to divide, to create barriers between. Okay. So, yeah. And that's so, uh, that's just what I believe. For but, the viewers, yeah. what do you understand about these puzzle elements? Well, you have a little, you know, barrier, a little line that goes around like a little snake. And, for example, um, that there would be isolating one, the blacks from the, the white dots. Um, but, and that seems to be working all the other puzzles I've done. And I was like, fine, okay. I've even done it where one of the streams is, you know, invisible, so it seems to work. But for this particular door, and this is like a side door, well, it doesn't work. All the, all the rules that I thought I knew don't apply, or at least, you know. So every time I try this, it just goes awry. And what, what about the hexagons? What are they uh, for? Oh, you have to go past them. The little stream, the little blue stream, you have to go past them. That's a must. If you don't, then it doesn't work. Okay. So show me show me the path that you, we, we tried earlier, just before we started recording. I think I started here, didn't I? Yes, I did start here. So well, explain, explain why you started there. Well, um, what was, it doesn't cross over itself. So you can't, because the, the stream can't grow itself like that. It blocks. And it seems to indicate, because some of these black dots, although they hinder you, they actually also help you and indicate where you're meant to be going. It's the theory, anyway. I believe I need to go to the bottom right hand corner to open this door. Okay. Um, every other thing doesn't seem to work because we've got these dots here. So I go chunking up there and then slice that. Yay! See what? That got done. And then I go through here and then splicing those two in half, you see? So they're isolated from each other. At least that's my theory. And then it goes like that, see? Because it needs to isolate those. Then I realise, oh, I've got to cover these two, so I'll do that down here. I'll go under and across and look, splice those two. Now, at this point, historically, I would actually go, because I haven't solved this at all, I'll go down here, and then... Um, do that! Thinking, well, we've got the barrier between white and black, yay, go me! And then do this, and when I do that, it, just, it, it won't work. I know it's not right, I'm not going to hit. I see, so... Why, why do you think this isn't working? I think these. I think I've got it wrong. I think the the dots and the things need to be grouped together. Oh, I see. So when you say isolate, yeah, uh, you're not isolating them from every other one. You're isolating pairs from each other. Not all of them from each other. So if the, in that logic applies, I could do that. Eh? Right. But the problem is, if you look up in the centre, there's this huge gap. It looks like a little dog thing, but there's there's a gap. And I'll just go up to my with it, well I can, I can try, but just in the middle here you see there's a, gl a grouping between the white and the black still because those dots there, but they're not adjacent to each other, and all the right. other things I've done before, they're not, they're always adjacent to one another, Okay. because so they're, 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 they're much smaller than this grid. So what's happened here is either you've got you've got the rule correct and you're applying it incorrectly, Yeah. or you've mislearned a rule, right? Mm. Which one do you think is more likely? The, the latter. Okay. So, what? why don't we go back to the bit that's teaching you about this and see if the solutions that you've got, if there is another explanation for that rule. Because you had a theory before about grouping, right? Mm. Why don't we go back to the tutorial and see if that's true or not for the ones that are correct. Well, we want to walk back there. We can do. Oh, okay. I mean, it's, I'm not, I'm not going to force you. It's up to you. No, it'll teach me something about... How the, I will run, everyone. Um, <laughs> so, okay, so this is the board. There's two boards here. There's a selection of blue ones and a selection of green ones. These are the blue ones. And these taught me what I thought about isolation. But looking at it closely, they don't. They teach me about grouping. Because if you see, look, they're grouped. Although there is one dot with no space in it. But it's grouped. They're grouped together. You, you lasso them around as a group. And then these other ones, which oddly enough didn't do anything when I finished them, which is kind of annoying. <laughs> um, they just taught me about the dots and having to go through them at any cost. Right. So I think if I apply the knowledge of grouping, or the, the phrase grouping as I understand it, that would actually be more successful. So let's try that. Where's the door? You could easily miss this thing. Oh, you do. You look got shadow. Anyway. <laughs> um, 
So, I still believe this is the right one to go for. Okay. Uh, because it seems to be direct to me to do that. But I have to unlearn what I've learned. Um, that's the left. I'm trying something different now. Okay. In the vain hope I can isolate these two. Yeah, because that's still... See, that's okay. the problem. So, so there, these, what's the problem here, then? The problem in the top... You still... If I do this... Yeah. Okay. Is there not the... No, that's good. Right now, it is good. Okay. You know? What was the problem you thought would happen? I thought there were... There was a link between... Or the, the space of the black dots shared the space of the white dots. But if I've got it right if you, now... If you do that little dog-like, then you... Yeah, yeah. I, I, okay. I actually resolved it, so it found itself. So here, I have to go through there, and then go there, that, that. There now before you press X, do you think this is successful or not? I believe this is successful, because the blacks are grouped together. It's terribly, <laughs> makes me feel sad. The black dots are grouped together, the white dots are grouped together. All the little things have been crossed over, and I've done a little hoop at the bottom to make sure that they're grouped together in the same space. So let's hit the turn and see what happens. Yay! <laughs> I had the exact same problem. <laughs> I went through the... Um, yeah, went through the tutorial, I had the exact same thing. It's like, oh, if they're paired together, I just have to separate them. That was the thing I learned, and yeah, it turned out that wasn't the case. That was awesome. What's this? 